Today, in this tutorial, I want to show you how to use the databases Education Source and ERIC to look for academic articles for your assignments or when you are doing research. Remember, both Education Source and ERIC are dedicated to education. From the university's webpage, click on the library icon. Hover over resources, click on electronic resources. Click on the A to Z database list link. Select E. Click on Education Source. Remember, you have to use your campus username and password to log in. Click on Choose Databases. You will find Education Source and ERIC on the EBSCOhost platform. Select both and click on OK. If you choose the basic search block, remember to combine your keywords or key concepts with the word AND. When selecting Advanced Search, you will see that the word AND is already there. It is important to break down your topic into keywords or key concepts when using a database. We are going to search for articles on quality education and democratic citizenship. Click on Search. Our search retrieved 17 articles. You can refine your results on the left-hand side. You can limit to scholarly peer-reviewed journals. That will assure that you get articles of a good academic quality. If you select the full text limiter, you will make sure to have full text access to the articles. Most important is to choose articles that was recently published. We have narrowed our search to seven articles. You can select the articles by clicking on this little folder there. It will turn yellow. When you scroll up, you will see the yellow folder there. When you click on it, the articles will be in the folder. You can select them and you can then print this. You can email them, save them, them in a file or from here, you also have full text access to the articles. You can choose any of the full text links to get to the articles. When we go back to our result list, you will find the title of the article, the author, the journal in which the article was published, the volume number, the number, the pages, and the date. When you scroll down, you will have the links to the full text access. Remember, when you choose full text from ERI or full text finder, you will have to click one or two clicks more to get to the article. PDF full text will, however, get you directly to your article. You can either download or print your article. On the right-hand toolbar, you will also be able to print, email this article, put it in the folder, 
or when you click on the site icon, you will have an example of the Harvard referencing method. So there you have the Harvard referencing method of this specific article. Remember to go through the abstract to see if the content of the article is what you want for your research or assignment. I hope that you will find this tutorial helpful.